3.1 Practice and Research. Using the research of Aldo van Eyck and his climbing frames, I continued to use the wooden lollipop sticks and then used them individually and considered how else I could rejoin and construct further investigations into shape. By this, I took my lollipop sticks and joined them with pastel shades of rubber bands. These pastel shades relate back to dyslexia education where pastel colours are used for stress relief and memory in learning. Further to these investigations, I then researched coloured overlays. These coloured overlays relieve visual stress. Pink the colour relieves visual stress. Yellow as a coloured overlay will generate memory. And these are some of the tools that are used in dyslexia education. Furthering the investigations into my construction and playground, I began to put more of the lollipop sticks together and think about how dyslexics are visually, technically capable of problem solving. Here, I've put a larger amount of lollipop sticks together, joined them together with the elastic bands, making them relate to the playground idea of creativity and I have now started to investigate the idea of movement. Now these samples will move between the fingers and I can play with them. They relieve stress, they are colourful visually and this is now going to further my investigations of making large scale samples and possibly moving these samples around the idea of the body.